closer to home now. We know police were on the heels of a stolen Subaru when they say the driver slammed into a delivery truck on Northeast 9th and Burnside. It was our breaking news at noon. Two people were arrested after they were pried out of the car that was damaged. Our Jennifer Dowling is live right now at the intersection where this happened. Yeah, that car was pretty smashed up. Witnesses tell us that the driver of that stolen car was going as fast as 80 miles per hour when it crashed. You can still see uh, some of the absorbent material out here in the intersection that uh, police and fire used to uh, soak up some of the fluids from that car. Now, police were following about a half a block behind, according to witnesses. And police tell us that they had seen the stolen Subaru, Subaru multiple times in the past few days. And today, they made their move to try to stop it. Lieutenant Tina Jones says that police put out spikes and they they were able to hit the car. It crashed into the delivery truck a few minutes later. Police say this wasn't a pursuit. However, witnesses say that officers weren't far behind. Bystanders tell me the truck had been making a delivery and had just gone through a green light on Northeast 9th when the driver in that stolen car T-boned it. I heard a like a whoosh kind of sound before the crash. I was like a block away. She was going too fast and uh, yeah, the damage was done. It was. Uh, yeah, not a fun sight to see. The driver of the delivery truck was not hurt. Witnesses thought that there were two women in the stolen Subaru. They say one of them was handcuffed and put in the back of a police car. The other appeared to have been taken out on a stretcher. Now, despite that observation, police released a statement saying nobody was injured in the crash, and police have not released the names of the two people that were involved. We'll hear more from police coming up tonight at 5 and 6. Back to you. Very fortunate. No, but no innocent people were hurt in this. Thank you, Jennifer Dowling.